Hey guys! Welcome to today's video. Today I will discuss how to write a recommendation letter for GKS scholarship. Many of you said you guys are confused about how to fill out Form 5 of the GKS application documents, which I will address in this video. Before we start, please hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any future videos posted on our channel. Let's start. Normally, when we apply for scholarship, one or two recommendation letters or LR must be submitted by the student's academic advisor or professors. In a conventional way, recommenders provide this letter on their official stamp pad, but in the case of the GKS scholarship, it is a bit different. GKS application requires a separate form, form number 5 to be exact, to be filled for the recommendation letter. There are some given prompts in the form like students' ability to adapt to a new culture, their potential, etc. which have to be mentioned by the recommenders when they write the LR. Even though there is a specific form for the LR, the given guidelines also say that if the recommender wants, they can provide the letter in their preferred format or template. This is where the confusion begins for the students. Should I ask the professor to fill out the given form, or should I ask for a conventional LOR? Since there is a specific form for the LOR, will it be wise to submit an external format? Will the professor be able to write everything within the short space given in form? What if I fill and submit both the GKS given form and a conventional LOR from the professor? Let us first discuss how you can overcome these and then I will tell you how you can fill out Form 5 of the GKS application. To solve the above-mentioned confusion, this is what you can do. When your advisor or professor will write the LOR, ask them to write a short letter about you based on the given prompts in Form 5 and fill it up. In the closing sentence, what the recommender can do is he can say, a detailed recommendation letter is enclosed with Form 5. For the detailed LOR, the professor will write the conventional LOR on his official stamp pad and attach it to Form 5. In this way, you can comply with the GKS application form and will also be able to provide a detailed recommendation letter. Now we will discuss how you can fill out Form 5. There are two sections in the form. Section 1 is to be filled out by the students, where you will write your name, your intended degree to apply, and the major you are applying for. Section 2 is to be filled by the recommender. The first box, given right below Section 2, just delete it. No need to fill that. After Section 2, just start from the part where the recommender's information is required to be filled. After filling in the recommender's information, in the second box, the recommender will delete the texts, only the texts not the box. After deleting the text, the recommender will write his summary form of a short letter with the given prompts which I mentioned earlier. So, this is how you can fill out the recommendation letter for the GKS scholarship. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel if the contents are helpful to you. See you again in the next video.